618, let's get you back out now to that breaking news this morning in Cape Coral. After a car slammed into a home, it happened on Palm Tree Boulevard and Southeast 43rd Terrace. And that's where this morning we find NBC2 Zuri Hoffman. She is live and local at the scene for us this morning. Uh, Zuri, you just arrived there on scene, but you just got some new information to share. Yeah, Alan, so this investigation certainly still in its earliest stages. I spoke with Cape Coral Police on scene. They told me at this point they know as much as us. So they're getting new information by the minute here. So again, this is on Palm Tree Boulevard and Southeast 43rd Terrace. I just want to set the scene for you. There's dozens or I should say a handful of uh, Cape Coral Police cruisers out here. Another handful of officers on scene. The investigation seems to be focused around this home here, and you can just see the damage from that car that just drove into the home. At this point, police tell me they are still looking for the driver. So here's some information that we do know that I learned from officers just minutes ago. They say a building and structure is currently on scene assessing damage to the home to make sure it's still safe. They are still looking for the driver. Now, our crew, we saw a chopper up in the air, canines on scene. So again, they are still looking for the driver at this point. Police tell me no reported injuries that they know of. Cape Police, they've been calling around to various hospitals trying to figure out if anyone was injured. They say at this point they don't believe anyone was hurt by this. They say they were flagged down around 3.50 this morning, so just a couple hours ago, where they found out about this scene. Again, you can see a handful of officers surrounding this car here. Cape Police, they are taking the lead on this investigation. At this point, once again, just to reiterate, they are still looking for the driver. We will, of course, keep you updated once we get any new information about this incident and this scene here. For now, live and local along Palm Tree Boulevard in Cape Coral, I'm Zuri Hoffman, NBC2.